Two episodes is 11. Yes, sir. Yes, yes, yes. Welcome we back. Are back. Welcome back. <laughs> Listen, we have the Free Jazz Podcast. It's episode 11. Free Gems. We got a very, 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 very special guest. But before that, listen, it's your host. You got Ed's with you. I got single to my Absolutely. right. Absolutely. And to my left, I got my brother, Jay High. Jay High. <laughs> listen, fresh out, yes. fresh home. Looking like money. You see what's going Absolutely. on? Absolutely. Thank man. you. Thank you for coming, bro. For yeah, that's big. Bro. Thank you for coming. You know what I'm saying? We appreciate everybody that comes out here, man. It's a lot of effort. It's a lot of work. So, listen, man, we're going to get straight to it because this is my brother. He, uh, he got a hell of a story. Uh, long story short, though, I'm, I'm not going to tell too much. I'm going to just summarize it. Man, he got locked up at a very young age, did a whole lot of time, and we about to talk about it, all right? <laughs> so, Jay, I go ahead and tell the people where you from. If you want to tell me your real name, it don't matter. You can just make something up, nigga. Nah, I'm not telling my name. <laughs> exactly. He's Jay High. I'm just Jay High. Yes, sir. Nah, I'm from Tina. Originally from New York, you were. Yeah, what part of New York, though? Tell them where you the actually Bronx, from. I'm from RBT. Okay, okay, RBT. Okay. You know, all them. Yeah, yeah, River Park Tower, <laughs> if I'm not Park mistaken, Tyler's. right? Okay, yeah, yeah. Tyler's. Yep. I mean, I just came here for my brother to tell my story. Yes, sir. Yes. I've been telling him since before we even started the podcast. I'm like, yo, bro, <laughs> I got to get you up here. I'm like, yo, and, and he was so sure. with it. Honestly, I, I thought you wasn't going to be with it at first. I'm like, I know niggas don't really like They're talk. Right, talk about that. But I'm like, nah, this nigga is retarded. Like, if you know this nigga, you know this nigga. Yeah, so we was young, bro. This nigga would just stop by my crib since niggas, we was like 15, 16. This nigga just stop by. Yo, what y'all niggas doing in there? Like, yo, I'm about to roll up with y'all. Yeah, niggas was doing the books. Yeah, yeah. All that shit. Young boy, Days. Wow. But yeah, Fuck man. Me. Um, so let's get right into it, man. So uh tell the people, all right, so you from RPT, River Park Towers, for those who don't know, legendary hood in the, in the Bronx, you know what I'm yeah, saying? Like legendary. Legendary. Uh shout out to D Things from the East from the Bronx. Free D thing, yeah, man. Of course. Free D thing. Tell, shout tell, tell what's going on. That's because you was telling me shout about D thing before he ever shout popped out to up. Uh-huh. Face. <laughs> Listen, man. So um I remember it was what, 2012, 2013, what was 2012. it? 2012. 2012. 2012, okay, yeah, yeah, okay. So 2012, man, I remember we was we was all chilling in school. And actually, yeah. after school, we start seeing the news and we see a whole situation that had happened <laughs> in Tina. And we like, yo, I'm not gonna lie, we all seen the footage and we was like, why yo, does this nigga look like, very familiar? Even though he had a yeah. mask on and all that. Legit, legit, we're like, yo, yo that's familiar. Familiar. It's so crazy. <laughs> yo. Everybody, that's what the whole case was basically on. Yeah. Everybody's saying that it looks like me. Bro, I'm like, like yo. That was the sickest shit in the world because I ain't gonna lie, nobody Seriously. second guessed it that knew you because we like, we know that walk, we know that Pico, know nigga. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Burberry Trench. <laughs> the Burberry Trench. <laughs> Burberry, <laughs> Burberry, Burberry, Burberry Trench is crazy. It's designer back But yeah, crazy. for sure. The back, back, back in the day, day yo, back forever, day. forever. Niggas was doing anything for design. Drug. Niggas was Facts. getting robbed. Niggas was selling weed. Niggas was doing whatever they could do. Bruh, of course. Yeah, 14, 15. That's all the motherfuckers was waiting on, like, truth be told. But um, so you was how old at the time? I was sixteen. Sixteen, okay. right? So I remember when um the whole situation had happened. It was a. Uh, I mean, you could talk about it exactly. What it was. I don't want to just. Make... I can just ask the question. All right, cool. Yeah, so, yeah, so, so, uh, right. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so yeah. Move, move. So talk about what happened. You already did the time, so you can pretty much talk about it, right? Yeah. yeah. I'm mistaken. So long story short, I was yeah. sixteen, mm -hmm. and I robbed what I robbed the store. You know, whatever the case may be. Right. I didn't get caught red-handed. Of course not. It's so funny though, right? Uh -huh. After I did the whatever I did, uh -huh. I was running. <laughs> I was running. Dumb ass running. Look, I was running, right? <laughs> The cops was right there. But they <laughs> watching your dumb ass. No, they ain't even know. I act like I was. I act like you was jogging. Shirt off, and I act like I was jogging at night. And I ran past my because you know I live right there. Yeah, so yeah, I ran yeah. Past yeah, right my up. block, uh -huh. and I ran down the next block and a hot pack in the back. Nigga thought he was getting low. <laughs> <laughs> he low. I got low. I got he low. like, I'm not gonna go down my block. I'm gonna go down next block. You know what it You know what it was. Like, you feel me? I'm gonna put it out there. It don't even matter. You it was my little sister, man. Like, uh -huh. Uh -huh. she was part of the reason why they was on me a little bit. Yeah, uh -huh. it's because, like, you know, she was a kid. Y'all about to say she was very, very young at the time. She was 14. So, it's right. like, at first, I was mad at her. I ain't gonna lie. I used yeah. to be mad in jail. Like, like man, that. she did this, that, and the third. But at the end of the day, I had to realize that she was a kid. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, for sure. I will never, like, I can never be mad at her no more. I'm nah, like, that's, yeah. that's, that's like, growth right there. Nice so, it's like, for real. At that time, like, don't get me wrong, it was her fault. A yeah. little bit to a certain mm -hmm. extent, cause she went back running her mouth. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. So That's everybody tough. was like, they seen it. Oh wow, you feel me? That that dude look like start him, putting two and two yeah, together. Yeah, yeah. Some people already was looking at it like, all right, that's probably him. That's yeah, probably yeah. Him. But then she like confirmed it. She put the confirmation. Yeah. In there. She went to school telling all her friends. Yeah, but I mean, you were kid, you were kid, you I was did a kid so. too. Yeah. So even doing them bad mistakes, like that's what this. I, I really want to point it to zero in on that. This episode, this is really about like how you can make mistakes at a young age, and go through what you go through, and Absolutely. come out. You feel me? Glorious. The, the, you got the rest of your life. You still young as hell. You know what I'm saying? Tell people. So how mu how much time? did you end up getting for uh, the I whole situation? I wound up doing the 
in New Jersey, the laws is different. I wound up doing a five with an 85 with five years parole. Shit. So damn near 10 years, really? Yeah. 85, when you down, you're supposed to do 85% of your time. Okay. Five mm -hmm. years, but you know, I was downstate and like being from where I'm from, mm -hmm. even both places, either if I'm saying from Teaneck or New York, yeah, yeah. they don't like, yeah, everybody's right. from different, like hoods, don't yeah. I'm cool with a lot of hoods, and, yeah. like from Jersey all around, Jersey City, Patterson, Trent, but like at first, they don't like care about that. Yeah, you right. Yeah. I just thought about like, you yeah. coming from a suburb. Suburbs. From, that's the yeah. suburbs. They hear T-neck. They're like, oh, it's sweet. Yeah, I'm coming from the suburbs. They don't even know what T-neck is when right. I say it's in my county. So yeah. when I say Bergen County, no, they laugh. They, 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 they talking money. Ching, ching, yeah. It's like, oh, you got money. Oh, yeah. Turn into right. dollars. Yeah. Something. So it's like, <laughs> oh yeah, so they be on me like yeah. That's so off the jump. I had to be like I'm from the city. Like yeah, nah, yeah. I'm that's aggressive now. So it's like all right. I feel like a lot of people probably are into that are from the city, but once you tell them Burton County, they think they're too lying when you probably say you're from the city. They probably yeah. like, like they probably like was like playing like, card and calling niggas and shit, like, doing whatever. Everybody, not even calling nobody because they don't know nobody. Ah uh, yeah, you're right. They it's, it's so crazy that I ran into like when I first got down there, I ran into somebody I played ball with. Oh wow, like, some street dude. Oh like, wait, like, from from the city? He's from North. Oh, uh, okay. but he used to like he used to be in team like playing ball. He knew a few balls from team. Oh, like, wow. like, that's cool. Wise. But like I wanted to get cool with him, and then I wanted to get cool like with a couple people because after after a while I just started to like having to get aggressive and like fight all. Because I was gonna say, so if you were sixteen, right? I was I was sixteen. I was in the youth house, right? And mm -hmm. then I went to I got sentenced around when I was eighteen, and then I went down state at eighteen. I was in the county for three weeks. Damn. Oh, damn! So, like, I didn't really get no. Like grown man prep, like when yeah. I went nah, to the county, yeah, nah, you went from not youth to yeah. 18, when I went to county, yeah. when I was in the county in Bergen County, I straight was like still on my young, my young mm -hmm. like, seventeen. Oh, I yeah, still, I was a young nigga still, so it was like I'm eighteen, whatever. I didn't know how to jail yet, so it's like mm -hmm. I'm with these old niggas. All I want to do is fight now, so yeah. Like, oh, because I think I have to prove. You something. think I, yeah? yeah what, as soon as you get there, you feel yeah, like okay, boom. I'm playing chess with one of my old heads. He he beat me crazy. Nah, I'm not just decking him. Yeah, yeah. I'm young. <laughs> oh, nah, yeah, you, but you was so young. Now they looking shit. at me like I'm stupid, and that's so crazy. I was on the tier with people from New York. Oh, that was wow. like, mm -hmm. you know, that was YG and stuff yeah, like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, you know? So it's like, oh, why? And I know them. So it's like, oh, why? I'm really good, but they ain't even care about me yeah, like that. Yeah, yeah. And you still got to, you now you feel like you got to prove yourself to them too. Exactly. Because you've been going in Jersey for a minute probably I gotta too. I got to prove myself to them because nine times out of ten, they were going to get back to the city. They going to yeah. get back to the city, and they going to be like, Yo, uh, uh, like he Damn. was in there not doing nothing. So now that's how I'm thinking in my head, and I know yeah. that they don't even care about what I'm doing as long as I'm all right. You yeah, and that's the fucked up part. Like, like you said, you didn't even know how to jail yet. So you so young, you in there thinking this is what you're supposed yes. to be doing. Set exactly. up, set ten toes down. And what I, I gotta do? And honestly, I ain't even really learned how to jail for a few years after I got down state. Like, I'll be shout honest. out to my bunkie ever, uh, man. He's home. Ah, uh, shout and out to him. He's from Patterson. He was. I was in the room. I was about. When I was, when I got in the room, I was nineteen. What's the wow. room for people who don't know? What's the room? I was in my how, cell. How old how old was he? When I was nineteen, he was I was nineteen, he was twenty seven. Okay. Oh, wow. So yeah. I was my oldest but he's yeah. he's he's old as hell right. Yeah. Like, yeah. Right yeah, I was about to say, damn, it was like ten years ago. Thirty seven right now. Yeah. That's crazy. Yeah. Yeah. But I be but, I be seeing him. I seen him a few times. I was just about Have you spoken to him after? Yeah, I always speak. I got his number speed, I always talk to him. I be, you know, giving him some zazz sometimes. One thing about that is the camaraderie when um people get locked up. Yeah, like afterwards y'all stay in touch. And it's so crazy that a lot of them is from Patterson to be honest. I was cool with majority, like more trend. And like more trained people in Patterson, like that's why I gravitate to because they was cool with me. Is like, it like a division between the cities? Like it's it always like, been a division between the two cities. You at first when I first got down there, it was it was gang and city, but more so city. Oh, mm -hmm. so like, the same city they would be like, together even if they opposite gangs to fight another city. Like if they, I think I've seen that for my like first two years. I think I've seen like two cities team up against other two cities. And on some I, tag I didn't even know that. I ain't even shit. heard of that. Tag team city is crazy. That's crazy. Too. But but majority of the thing it was city. So it was like I ain't even have no city. So I was just. I just, right. yeah. I just oh. beat myself. I was just myself. <laughs> that honestly might, might have helped you. Yeah. Help. Being yourself, mm -hmm. for anybody, like, if you ever, like, I don't never wish jail on nobody, but if that was never. to ever happen, just go down there and be yourself. Like, don't never don't, yeah. think you have to portray anything because I went down there not being myself. That's and I got into a lot mm -hmm. of 
like fights for no reason. Yeah, I mean, man, yeah, you, know, yeah, you, you know, gotta. Man, I ain't gonna lie, but we used to hear all the stories because I, I remember like like Nas and a bunch of other people was getting locked in and out at the time, and they kept telling like, yo, everybody talking about yo J High in there, wild and like yo J High in there, fight J High and getting getting stayed to a lot. Ain't know it's the crazy part. I was wilding majority of my bid, but only reason why at the beginning I could I could honestly say it was for dumb things. Right? Yeah, mm-hmm. but like towards the end, the majority the the. The thing you don't get over the like a fight over mostly over in jail is the phone. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, about so phone time. To, phone yeah. time. I have to like like when I the first jail I went is twenty three and one. We used to come out mm-hmm. for, for one an hour. hour by rooms though. Like the first three rooms on each side, the even and the odd oh side. God. Damn, you come out for thirty, but you come out for an hour, and so you don't even get that hour. Like the first wreck will be the only one I probably get the four hour. It'd be A B C. First three rooms, middle three rooms, last three rooms. Damn. The wow. last two wrecks you only get in about forty five. Like minutes, and then I have motherfuckers and, and, on high. Oh, be from the hood, so like if you like you got canteen. Canteen was bad then. Like commissary was OD bad then. Wait, wait, which if jail nobody was don't this? know. This was Yarville. This is oh uh, yeah, I've heard of Yarville. That, Yarville. This was Yarville. Like damn. Oh, that's the only jail that I was at that's still open right now. Oh, so the, the, everything else. The, the other two jail, the other two jails is closed. Annandale, like Mountain View, that's like right like twenty like thirty minutes from here, and Bordentown, Gladiator School. I was, I've heard of that. That was the best slash worst jail to be in. Like, why you say that? If you're not aggressive at all, if you don't have an aggressive bone in your body and you soft, request to get out of the check in. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> check in, check in. Tell your lawyer, check in. Don't be there. Don't go. Don't go. Listen, this is a good warning talk. I said all the youth, not even don't just go. the youth. There's grown people grown out here that's watching too. this, man. Yeah, listen, man. It's 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 not a game. It's it's real. It's a serious. Like, like <laughs> and seeing this at a young age, I can only imagine you had to be 18, nervous. Like around people, youngest nigga around me was 23. I'm yeah, it's 23. So like my first fight was nigga some poppy dude from Patterson. 23. Oh man, I had to go crazy. You fighting grown men. Yeah, legit. There's a difference between an 18-year-old and a 25-year-old. I lost lost three fights in jail, and a person will never forget the fights that he lost in jail, especially if it's not that old. Respectfully. I lost three fights in jail. And and the people that can fight count. They can really fight. (laughs) (laughs) I gave them one for money. I ain't going to lie. Matter of fact, the first fight, no, the second fight I ever lost, I ain't going to lie, he was from Jersey City. How long is he in were you at that point? The other person? No, the first and the second fight. We'll get into that second fight. How much he was? How old are you? At this point, how old were you? When I was, when I was, when I was, him, when I was fighting the, uh, the 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 second fight I lost, I was about to tell you about. I was nineteen. Oh shit! Yeah. He was and he was twenty five. Oh yeah. Man. And he was already known. Like you no, know, you grew up with me. I don't care yeah. who you are. Yeah. yeah. He was, he was yeah. already known. And look, he was S Double M too. You know that's okay. what you know right. me. Yeah. But like he was from Jersey City. He was older. I ain't gonna lie. Uh-huh. He was known on the tier for like just beating yeah, us up. Yeah. So like niggas used to be scared. It'd be a select few Keep people. Stack. You, you was like, a little shaky at first, like man, I, gotta I do was, this right now. I was, but we used to play around all yeah, day together. So, so you kind of knew, 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 yeah. knew, 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 knew you had so his like, body. That's my really man. So it's like ah, I bet. But the rooms, I promise you, was small. Like mm. like like probably from like right here to there. Like that's your fighting room. And that's metal. that's and that your metal fighting room right yeah. there. Oh, oh that's yeah. tough. Toe to toe, 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 toe for yeah. real. Toe to toe, toe for real. You can't in really it. step back no Toe to toe, so toe, toe, toe for real. And look. Listen, man. This ain't for me. <laughs> I can tell you. Yeah, this uh, ain't for me, nah, nigga. Look, though. <laughs> look right, though. Any way you swing, you might hit something. So it's all jabs. Uh, so you have to throw oh, all jabs. Crazy. You can't throw no hook. So you hand the bump. You uh, in a fucking closet. Either this side you hand the bump or you hand the closet you on this side. Breaking handles. Yeah, this is y'all room. This is y'all room. Right. Like, other jails it wasn't like that, but this is y'all room. Toe to toe for real. Yeah. This is the first jail they sent me to. They ain't let me choose another. They just straight sent me there. So it's like odd. When I was in there. I was, we was fighting, right? Uh-huh. Yeah. I was getting, I'm playing the wall. Oh, yeah. It's I'm hard. getting <laughs> the best, I'm getting the best of him. Uh-huh. For me, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's another gym right there. If you was to ever have to be in a situation like that, <laughs> get play the wall. wall. Yeah, can't never get behind you. <laughs> I'll never not play the wall, bro. Especially me, because, like, he got his whole city over there. No matter yeah, he, he already, yeah. They don't yeah. care if you, if we both the same set or anything, bro. <laughs> yeah, like, they could like, be the same. They playing cities right now. You yeah. the city, I could be cool with them and all that. Yeah, they don't like, nah, nothing. stay man. I was I played the wall. I didn't even know it was like that though. You know, yeah, I didn't really even It'd know that. It'd be towns you never heard of down there. That yeah. I was like, I didn't even know y'all was like on the map. Yeah. <laughs> for real though. Salem and stuff like yeah. that. Like, You'd be surprised if like, the fuckers from New Brunswick I didn't know. Shit. Yeah, New Brunswick for real. I heard about that I know people from Plainfield New Brunswick. Like, Shout out to the Plainfield home. Shout out to New Brunswick too. My man just came home from over there. Oh, that's what's up, man. I love hearing people coming home. AC too, for real. Oh, I know. Atlanta City's crazy. like that, Atlanta City is crazy. Yeah, so now back to the story. So we get into it. We fighting with everybody. We playing the war. 
I'm playing the wall. <laughs> I'm getting it. I ain't really know how to play the wall like how I do now, uh-huh. bro. But at that time, that was like one of my like fifth, sixth fights. I ain't really know how to play the wall, but uh-huh. I knew I knew better to go to it and learn. Yeah. So I was like, I, I'm getting the best of him. Uh-huh. I swear to God, I was getting so cocky, I threw some dumb shit. <laughs> <laughs> he slipped it and uppercutted the uh, shit out of me. Oh and then jabbed me. Boom. I hit the I hit my head on the wall. I couldn't see. <laughs> I was thinking that playing the wall, I'm like, once you hit your head, hit that's like getting punched twice. Yeah. Now look, I hit my head on the wall. Boom. Uh, I can't see. <laughs> nigga went blind. Shout out to my bunkie I just said from Patterson. Oh, I can't man. wait till you see this. His bitch ass. I can curse, right? Yeah, 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 yeah it's, good. It's not, it's not hot now. Nah, yeah, it's not saying. <laughs> yeah. yo, I keep, yo, shout out to his bitch ass. This nigga's on the bed. I'm like, yo, help. I can't see. <laughs> it's like, help is crazy. <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah, I can't. <laughs> nah, help is crazy. Yeah. Help is crazy. Yeah. 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 It's like my eyes. <laughs> Yeah, like my eye, he telling me my eyes is open, oh, but they they, nah, like, they, they like but they not. Like I'm like, oh, he hit. Now like, he really know like he hit hard. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. He, yeah, yeah. he, he sucked his thumb you. all day. Like he <laughs> putting power into oh, his face. Nah. We're in two. <laughs> he his thumb all so, day. So now nah, he decked me. So I'm like, oh, yeah. yo, bunky. Yo, <laughs> yo, yo, just look. <laughs> yo, bunky. Your eyes open. I'm like, so I grab for it. Like, right, yo. <laughs> yo, I'm crying. Ain't gonna lie. Nigga said your eyes open. After that was over. After that was just over. Yeah, he started going on me, and then my bunky in the room because I had to. Go to court line because uh-huh. I had got a blue sheet. A blue sheet in jail is like when the CEO writes you for a charge, whatever. Uh-huh. You gotta go to court. You could possibly go to locker for that. You uh-huh. possibly go to the box. Yeah, the box. That's... So. When my when he leave, me and my bum in there, Bunky like, yo, what happened? Like, what? <laughs> yeah, he's like, like yeah. he said, nigga, you had him, you bitch ass. Yeah, he got, <laughs> got, <laughs> got cocky, got cocky. <laughs> Respectfully, got him, he knew you had some shit on him. Yeah, you had him at first. He's like, nigga, you, you, nigga, you could have done, nigga, you was a bitch. Nigga. Oh, <laughs> God, I can't wait to, I ain't helping. <laughs> See, but like most niggas wouldn't even admit that story right there. You know nah, what I mean? That's what I love. I love like, I, I love niggas that can acknowledge their losses, and then that helps you grow. Absolutely, that was the last loss I ever had. And you know, I'm never doing no dumb shit like that. <laughs> yeah, after that, even if even now, <laughs> I swear to God, my the last job I was just at, it was so sweet down there. Yeah, it was. I was down there in it. I was down there with Denzel. Shout out to yeah, Denzel. Yeah, shout out to Denzel. Denny. He in the halfway house right now. Yeah, man. he be home soon. So it's like, yo, no bullshit. It was so sweet down there. I was just like, that's not got cocky and dumb. Now yeah. it's like, uh, we fighting now. You not even like that. <laughs> my slaps to you your punches. Your temperature. Nah, my slaps to your punches. Oh, that's great. That's how niggas really be in there? No, that's what I used to call it. Like a few people. <laughs> nah, I think I've even heard like one other person say that before. My slaps said to your me. punches. He, he put on great. the training wheels. That's that's slap. Slap. Literally, yeah, that's like, that's like the, put on the angle weights. Yo, with three slaps. <laughs> Yo. Because that's when I got, like, I was big before that. And my biggest, I was probably when I was at, um, and I was in boarding town in the camps because I used to work out three times a day with my man. My yeah. man Holiday, he home free. He from Nook. Shout, shout out to him. Shout out to Holiday. I ain't gonna lie. All day, he wake up in the morning and work out. Mm-hmm. Afternoon, yo, what you doing? Get up. Because we was in the dorm. Mm-hmm. Uh, the dorm is like when you come inside the dorm, like the little dorm is is one, two, oh, so three, three, four. Oh, no, it's cubes. Oh, okay. It's so cubes. is it closed off though? It's like when you come into it's like how you walk into here. Uh-huh. This is like this would be the dorm right here. Uh, so how many people? Like six? No, hell no. You got. In that time, it was nobody could get on the bunk on the top bunk. So it was one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And, oh matter of fact, I'm bugging. It was one bunk in the back, on the top. That's nine. Uh-huh. And my man Holiday was in there. We used to just work. We used to do pull up, and my man Stacks too from Elizabeth. Mm-hmm. Shout out to Stacks, he free. Shout we out used to Stack. go. Straight to the pull up bar inside the shower. Like the shower was our pull up bar. Like when uh-huh. we don't go outside, that's what we do. We had a water bag. Like, we had fill a bag of water, oh, put it in the net yeah. bag, and then like we had take like one of the like magazines or something like that, roll it up, put it in the sock, tie it up, and that's our little weights <laughs> right there. Yo, yo that the yeah. innovation the energy, yo, that, was crazy. Oh, nah, you'll be surprised. Yeah, oh, the what they could do? Like, I can imagine. We used like, to smoke in jail. Like, the DIY smoke the project? tobacco. To- you right. ever got some weed in jail? Hell yeah, I used to smoke weed in jail. <laughs> but I heard niggas in jail be smoking um, K2 and shit nah, too. Niggas smoke that it's like they got niggas had you in smoking spice give it a snack you smoke it I smoked it one time I smoked it one time that means you're doing that shit for a week nah I did it one time nah this whole thing I tried it one time I ain't gonna lie I tried some fake ass K2 in like New Orleans he said never again it was crazy yo bro I thought Kevin Durant was in the room everybody who knows me nigga said Kevin Durant this happened before I came home in 2017 that's when KD was in the Warriors anybody who knows me I told this story to them before I took like 
three pulls. My son from Brooklyn gave it to me. I took like three pulls of that shit. He gassed me to do it. I'm like, I'm not doing that weird shit, bro. I did it, bro. I'm at the door. Then I'm like, all right, bro. I'm at the door. I sit down. <laughs> nigga walked in my room. <laughs> Who, KD? KD. Yeah, nah, 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 before nah, the nah. game. I'm like. I'm out. I'm out. With the jersey on. You know, <laughs> no, me. I played it up. It's good, my nigga. <laughs> yeah. KD is yeah. good, my nigga. <laughs> I was smacked. I'm like, nah, I'm not doing this shit. Nah, nah bro, right. too, never again. See, talk about bro, that too, though, because you had actually came home for a little bit. And I came home for a month, and and at that time you were supposed to. I caught up at the to... wrong time. I was on parole for five years. Right. I, that's why I'm gonna tell. I'm gonna start back at the five with eighty five. You're supposed right. to do fifteen percent of your time. Mm -hmm. I got in trouble a little bit too much, so they took my fifteen. So I had to do the whole, whole five. Fifteen percent of the fifteen percent yeah. of five years Don't is fifteen <laughs> years. Fifteen percent. Uh, five years is four years and three months. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I was supposed to do that, but I wound up doing four years and 11 months. Yeah, the whole five, five years. Wow, yeah, five, five years. Year. I came home for a month, and I have to do five years parole, day for day. Oh. But I wound up getting off early. Shout out to that. I was supposed to get off September 20, 2022, and I got off in March off of my brother's birthday. Oh, that's nice. So I got off Shout early. out to that, for real, for real. So I wound up going home for a month. And I was with the wrong people, wrong time. I ain't mm -hmm. gonna say no names. Yeah, so yeah, yeah. Nobody like stuff happened. It was a lot of different stories in the end, but me and that person know the real story. Mm -hmm. you know? Right. And I wound up getting the violation for that. I, I, I went to the precinct. I came home, and then the next day I had to go to parole anyway to see him. Uh, mm -hmm. and you knew it was he over. Lied he was on me. Now? Like I knew it was over my head because I already heard his vibe when he called. When I called him, energy. I already heard his vibe and yeah. his energy was. Over. Energy and I'm was like, different. Yeah. I just don't have to go, but I've never been that type of person not to just right. face the stuff I have. To yeah, do yeah. So like I'm the person I'm gonna just get it over with. Like accountability. That's another that's, job that's right a there. Big, yeah. I ain't gonna never like. I will never take nothing on the run because at the end of the day, now I have to watch my back. Yeah, I got to do this down the third. Man, I'm going to just go get this done. Man. Let, so, let, let, let me sit and do what I got to do. Yeah, let me do me? it. Let me, let, me, like, let me go see what's going on. I went to talk to him. I passed my drug test. <coughs> like, you still smell like weed. I'm like, what? Like, oh like I, had got, I had to get a ride here. I know I don't have no transportation, so like I can't control what other people do. Did I smoke? No. Y'all just test me as day. Y'all could test me again and again right. and again. I wasn't smoking. Mm -hmm. I don't smoke at all no more, period. Right, right, right. So they like, um, nah, whatever. So that he called the LT and the supervisor lady. They came in, left, making it seem like I'm about to slide. And they came back with the cuffs. Oh, man. man. I know. I was that shit yeah. nightmare. Yeah. I was supposed to do a year. I'm in the camps. For, like, for that, the camps in jail is like a step before the halfway house. Yeah, right. I heard about the yeah. camps. When you have four points or less, when you have gang minimum status, full minimum status, you go to the camps. You wear a different color. You get to work on the street details, like highway I've heard detail. That. Like I used to work in, like we used to do highway detail. Go to Trenton, cut grass. I worked in the real restaurant in Trenton. Oh wow! Oh wow! Right. Yeah, you get I'm to be YouTube basically. It's, it's I think I showed you that before. I was on YouTube. <laughs> you had mentioned it to me, but I didn't, I didn't get that. Like you a put real it up. chef making shrimp skin. <laughs> 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 See, that's like, the thing. Though. <laughs> Jail teaches some skills. Yo, 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 some real, some real right skills. I got my forklift license. I got my OSHA ten license. Yo, that's great. What? I have my, I have my forklift license certificate. Where I can work out of. A real restaurant. You were doing more than most a people was doing outside. I was, Yo, I was, yeah, you said you was in a cutting head, hustling, cutting, yeah, I, was, like that. I was cutting the offices here. Sound like crazy. a Jamaican. That's how you know it's official. A motherfucker that can yeah. get off the property and go get a haircut. I was like a Mexican. Nah, dude. nah, legit. <laughs> Yo. Look at every job. Every, 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 Yo, job. every okay. important job I had it so I could get uh, juice yeah. and I could be able to move around. You yeah. was talking about shrimp scampi. Hold on. So, like, you had a favorite meal in there? Because I always heard, like, people talk oh, about they make some crazy shit. Oh, nah, you used to make the hookups. Like, I was the cook, so, like, my niggas would come to me, like, yo, cook, especially Benny, look. Ugly, uh -huh. That was my bunkie. Yo, come on, boy. You want to eat me? Like, what are the odds your niggas end up being bunkies? That's what? crazy. What are the I first odds? seen him. That yeah. nigga was huge. Bro. I, I heard him. I, I seen the picture. Then he was puny. Yeah, 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 yeah. I seen him yeah. in person. You know, he's a clown. He mad big. I'm like, yo, your body look fake. He like, yo, bro. He got the door open. He like, yo, bro, fuck that, man. Like, yo, give me a hug. Man, I, I thought I'd never see you again in my life. <laughs> nah, <laughs> like, what? I'm like, yo, man. Yo. Nah, man. So, like, we used to make the hug. We used to crush the soups up, get the right, blow the rice up. Put a little bit of water, shake it up. That shit always that's you have to have a stinger, but they don't sell stingers in New Jersey drugs. If I'm, if I'm not mistaken, they're selling in the adult prisons like Northern and the Rollway Train. Yeah. But like, you know, being a youth correctional facility, yeah. you could be oh, 28 and down to go to be in that jail. In oh, that's, I didn't wait. even know that. But you could be 32 in the jail, but you had to been there before you was before 28. You, okay. okay. So niggas, I was there with niggas I was 32, 33. I've heard, wow. I've heard some shit. Like, I ain't never I, heard I, that I've heard before. people in juvie that were like 21, 22, like at Jamesburg. Motherfuckers be 21 yeah, in that cause They, cause, they cause, caught their time at like 17 or 15 yeah, and they, or some they, shit. They, like, they be downstate and then they come grab them and finish that time down there. Wow. Jamesburg. And Jamesburg was worse than a lot of these. That's what I always heard. I definitely heard. 
probably that. worse, like, yeah. to be honest with me. So it's like, all right. Um, Back to what you were talking about, the oh, stinger. Oh, yeah, so the stinger. The stinger with people who don't know. You have to make a stinger. Tell them what a the stinger is if they don't know. A stinger know. is something that you put in hot water to make your food hot. But a stinger is, is like uh-huh. if we was to get like like a wire like that right there, like any wire like that, like we used to break our fans for me, like get a broken fan, uh-huh. take the wire off. You have to split it, like how you see split, the split. The wire, like yeah, you inside. see how the split is, uh-huh. like you split it, and then you get a nail clip. You break the nail clip in half. You get like the little gel toothbrushes. They like this small. Uh-huh. You rip the bristles. You take a nail clip and rip the bristles off, and you put it in there, tie it up between the nail clippers. And then you put, that's genius. You you put like you, like the you strip it on each side, mm-hmm. yeah, the, wire, the wire, yeah, uh-huh. and then you take like the little wire parts inside of it, right? And you wrap it around each hook on each side of the nail clipper, and then you plug it in. It's like put a little sword on it and start going crazy. A start little sword. <laughs> nah, going what crazy. the fuck? Oh, so yeah. all that you produce basically like heat, like like Ooh, it's like you put it inside the water and, and it has it, the whole water boiling. Oh, yeah. Then, like, I heard I, that shit boils water faster than the stove boils. It do in ten minutes. We we'll put salt on it, like five minutes. Put salt on it. That's fucking. You crazy. put a lot of salt, it go crazy. But it knock your power out for the room, and then you gotta oh. pay the CO. He want he want commissary to come out like to put your CO on commissary. You gotta get Doritos. That nigga go to the store. Want. What you mean you want commissary? Nah. It's weird in there, man. Nah, it's it's weird in there. Nah, it's it's weird. That's why I be seeing COs. I be ready to knock them out. Like, <laughs> nah, like, nah, his personal. Nah, like, nah, he want your commissary. I see. But, yeah, for real. He want my chips, <laughs> my honey buns. Like nigga, I can't get nothing. He want my soups. Like he want my soups. Like nigga, you like soups? Crazy. There was a CO in there from the Bronx, right? Tell him I need three soups, nigga. When I was just. Last year, see your nigga poppy nigga from the Bronx. He like, yeah, yo. I'm like, yo, what's up? I could be. Like, I got mad time and I don't belong in my room all day. Like, we yeah. come out for three hours in this jail, three and a half hours at Man, night. That like a you come out, yeah, to an hour, though. yeah, three and a half hours. At, no, that jail was so sweet. You come out for like two hours in the morning. You come out again at twelve thirty to two, and then you come back out at five thirty to eight thirty. Damn. Oh wow. TVs and all that. TV in the day room, and that and that jail you didn't have the TV in the room. The other two jails I had TV in my room. And your actual like they had a low TV. I had cl- it was a clear tunes. They had the converter box like the bubble back TV. The and we used to have the antenna. Nah, not the antenna. Yeah, 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 the like antenna like in the nineties, nigga. Bill, nah, down in Yardville, you had the antenna. You got to tape it on the wall. <laughs> nah, down nah. Border Town, well, down Border Town, they gave them cable. So when I got there, it was cable. What the like, fuck? What? TNT, <laughs> BNT. I was watching. Watching the game. I was watching the game. What's your favorite show on TV? I always heard. I always heard Snowfall. Snowfall. Oh yeah, that's a Snowfall since the start of it. Like Blacklist. I put people on there. Shows like that. Snowfall. 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 Like, not times in everybody in jail read, right? Mm-hmm. But it's all about what you read. Yeah. 100%. Like, yeah. when I first came down, I felt my head up with that nonsense hood shit, you feel me? Oh, yeah. so you reading her books? Yeah, I read her oh, books. Wow. Don't get me wrong. They was good. They was good, you feel me? They was all right, you feel me? But, mm-hmm. like, it's all the same plot. It's the yeah. negativity. Yeah. You still it's got that negativity. Right? Right? Not, not even that, though. Not even just that. Like, I mean, let me take it. Like, let me be dumb for a second. Yeah. No. It's all the same thing. It's Every the same book story. I read is... The nigga start off rich, right. he got a bad bitch, <laughs> he got caught cheating or something like that. She took him back, um, and then the nigga got killed. Sounds about it's or, the same or, story. Or, the, the, nigga, the nigga started off broke, and he miraculously found a plug and got 100 bricks. <laughs> 100 <laughs> he got 15 yeah. cars. He turned chapter three. He didn't turn around with 100 bricks, 15 cars. Yeah, now for sure. <laughs> then he got a girl. He the told though he got killed. Yeah, yeah, I mean, that's every almost, single. We think about it, that's every hood movie that's too. Every hood yeah. movie. That's why I don't watch that stuff like yeah. that. Same so, story. So like, and then I transferred over into reading like good books. Like shout out to my man Greg, man. He's he was he was down in the deal with me. Like he was a great Greg. great dude. He came home off on the pill. Yes, sir. Just all the pill. That's on, a that's on, a W. Bro. Like he he got me right. Him and my man Quincy, my man. He's from New Brunswick. He came home too. Like they got me. Like got me right. I ain't gonna lie. Good. Like they had me right off the workout tip. Like we work out. Like, cause I had fell off, so my man G mm-hmm. Money, like, I don't know. He tell me he not in the he wasn't in the military, but his family was. But I knew he was lying. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I knew be. he was lying, but cause we worked out military workouts yeah. every day. Like, he want to do mad weird shit. shit. <laughs> like, he want to do mad weird. He want to do squats with the weights, <laughs> like hanging right here, right yeah. like, yeah. over you. Like, he want to do weird stuff yeah, I never heard about <laughs> before. Straight so, military shit. But I was getting my weight up and I was getting my mind right, cause of him, and I yeah. always would appreciate him for that. 
reading good books. So I, I I read a hundred good books more than once. Wow, nice. Wow. Book, more than the, once. The, the, like Forty Eight Laws of Power. Right yeah, yeah that's fifteen one. times. I was gonna ask yeah. you what's your favorite. Book I was about to ask you that too. I, that about I, was, about, I was about to ask you that too. You can't read a book one time no. and really understand. It, you have to read it multiple I, times. I, I like, say the same. It's like a movie. Yeah, like watching a movie. Sometimes like. You when can't you're watch a movie, movie and understood it off the jump. You have to watch. You watch it, it from another perspective again. Yes. Sometimes I read, you read that book from yeah. another perspective, and you like, learn new things every time. That used to be for my real, favorite real. book, but then I read so many. I, I read a book on like, and like it's like it's called the Big Black Book of Income Secrets. It's it was of it was secrets. it was four hundred and some pages on how to like on different ways on how to get money. It was probably like wow. thirty chapters in there on how to get money. Then I read How to Gain Friends and Influence People. Oh, that's a great it's book. Amazing. Book. Girl, I read that. I read that. That's a great book. I read How to Win Friends and Influence People. It's a, it's a, it was a lot of good books. I'm trying to think right now. I read The Art of Seduction. Great book. Oh, that's a great book. I read that one as well. That's a great book. That's a great book. Great book. Art of War. This is a great book as well. I read The Fifth Element, if I'm not mistaken, that's called. Yeah. I heard about the, it. I've never heard like, Yeah. I'll be talking to Chris Cuss. Me and Chris Cuss, we be chopping up Yo. books. Like, we be trading books sometimes. That's what's that's up. What's up. Um, the Key to Success. I read a lot of books. I read um, a lot a lot of books. That, that, that's... I'm trying to think of this other one I was like. Um, it was by Napoleon Hill. Um, um, Thinking Grow Rich. Thinking Grow Rich. Thinking Grow Rich. I read that book. Um, Thinking Grow Rich. Oh my God. <laughs> no, yeah, <laughs> Napoleon Hill. That's a great. That's, that's a great book. That's fire though because I know in you, OB. like I know me. If we was, if you was never in that situation, you would have never read a book. Never, ever, yeah. ever. All her books. I was reading her books before. Yeah. And, <laughs> but but then but then you saw your growth while you were there. I was gonna ask you. Um, you first getting in there compared to towards the end of your sentence. How do you feel you were a, a my different person? First starting, and then when I went back, like right, a back. total, a total difference. Oh, okay. like a total difference. Like now, like when I went back, like I, like, like not to be like a negative. I always knew I had five years before. I always knew in the back of my mind, it's a chance I'm not gonna be able to do that whole five on the streets. Damn. So like when I came home, like it's not in there for everybody to always finish parole. Right. No matter what you like, no matter what you get into, whether you come home to be back in the streets, right. to try to be in the streets and do work or just straight do work, like it's really really hard. Not Cause yet, cause like, anything can you get can you do, It's not even that you can do good, and they're gonna still expect. Like you could do what they expect. And then they're gonna switch up the expectations and make yeah. it harder. Yeah, and even like, some, like, even like speeding. Door for like, I came home, when I came you home back last up. time. When I came home last time, I had a job. Yeah, that wasn't enough. Like that's what y'all wanted. I was that wasn't enough for them. I was staying yeah. out of trouble. Like I was following. I have no curfew. I was doing good. They, like all of that stuff went out. The, when, when you do one thing negative or anything like anything that's negative, no matter how big it is, it outweighs everything that positive. Yeah. That you everything you have. Yeah, it's so like. It's like like it's like, that, like it that's that like, hard pressure that comes with that whole that, situation, that, and it's exactly like they so. they know probation, parole is still like a form of jail, but it's just jail in your mind, which yeah, is almost yeah, damn near deeper jail, than jail. Because like you still got to report to them, that, yeah. like, follow their rules, and think about really like, if I do anything door. wrong. Let me, if I step the wrong way, like for damn, real, my parole was gonna be on me. Yeah, my parole was gonna be on me. So and then like, there's so much temptation out here because at any point you could pick up the weed, you could pick up a bottle, you could you know what I'm saying do this and that, you can get in the car and drive drunk. And I know I know people that that had that got sent back for DUIs and certain simple shit like. I know somebody who got sent back for taking a Tylenol extra strength. What? That's the, different. What you mean? Tylenol, tylenol extra, extra strength, strength, strength bro. <laughs> that shit, that's not funny, but that's... extra strength, bro. That was mad funny when yeah. I, seen, <laughs> I seen that. <laughs> nigga. It was mad. When I seen that nigga, I'm like, yo, <laughs> nigga, you ain't Tylenol. Tylenol. We chop, you know how you chopping it up when yeah. you first get up with a nigga? I'm like, yeah, this is when I first went downstate. Um, I was 18. We, when I first went downstate, it's so crazy. My first experience downstate was in the box because it was no room on, on, on like pot. it was so was filled no up yeah, yeah. yeah. like and, and, and classification on me in the intake in the intake drum you couldn't like it was no space so it was like we put us in lockup so yeah. I, I had to suffer for a whole like five days was not coming out at all yeah, wow that, you that's your first day out the box shower every the, other day people oh, don't that's understand. how it is in the box the box is not a fucking game they put you in the man it's a jail inside the jail so how fucking crazy oh, no, let me that tell be? you about the box let me tell you about the real box it's that called ass break you. the real box is called ass egg right okay when I went to ass egg the first time I did five months in the box right what it's people, that, it's people I know that was, did 730 days in the box. That's two years. That's two years. No people was back there for two years. Like, nah. I know people who got sentenced to the box for five years, but they had stopped that. But like, they still under them sentences and guidelines. How do they nah, come out of their human, nah. bro? Like people don't. I know people that's really crazy. lost their mind. Oh back yeah, there. yeah. Crazy. That's the that, point of it. Listen, like, I did. Like, I did like a whole all together in the box. I did a year. I did back to back five six months. Like I did a year oh, in the box. Wow. But you he know what I did? Wild. I just read books. Like you yeah, you got you got you got you got to keep your mind stimulated because it's easy. Stay in room you don't come out you come out you come out every other day it depends what your door is 
Like whatever yeah, your door number is, like if I'm in room six, or I come out on even days to just go to the shower. They don't wait. Hold on. There's not the hour of wreck. None of that. No hell no. Nah. You don't come out. You come out one time a week. You, you come. Like, I'm about to break it down thought, to you. I thought they legally had to get you wrecked. No, I'm about to break it down to you. Yeah, I'm about to break it down to you. Whoa. You come out like I. Right, I'm gonna tell you my schedule from when I was the first time I was in the box. Yeah. We come out. We go to. The, it's a cage too. It's a box again. We come out in the cage about this size. We had JPEG kiosks. I said you can play. Or your man's who got cars, or whatever. Just set the tape, play cars, or you get on JPEG. Come in, you be out there for 45 minutes inside the cage. Uh huh. One time a week. That's it. Well, Wait, that one time 45 a week. minutes is once a week? Yes, once a week. Whoa. You go to the man. yard. They, we they went to the they, yard. They trying all the limits to see how crazy can we turn they you got a yard. They got a yard for us, too. We got a yard, right? It's like a, it's like a certain kind of yard. Like I've seen that in movies. It's it's just, it'll it's it'll a, be like it's in a, a gated box. Yard. Yeah, it's a gated mm-hmm. box. Wow. Yeah, but it's outside, though, for me. So it's like gated. So all. you still get air and wind. Still but air, it's like, yeah. like, like we see people. Metal. Yeah. Because yeah. we see people like people that work in the box. People that got to serve. It's like regular inmates. I worked in the box to serve people. Oh, yeah. Serving food and shit like that? You got to serve food to them. Inmates do it for me. And we cook the food. I used to be cooking the food for inmates in the box. You Make sure I used to make sure they was good. Like, yeah, of course. Because God knew how it was to be exactly. back. So yeah. Like, All right, people I'm close to that's right next to the kitchen. Got you. Don't mad yo, food. That's, yo, food. that's <laughs> love. My man's I'm going to make sure I got a little extra. It's a charge, niggas, though. Like, certain <laughs> niggas, like, contract, <laughs> contract $50 a month. Send it to my cash app. Like, contract is great. Yeah. Yeah. Respectful. You got to do to survive. Yo, yeah. coffee, I bought coffee, $5 on Canteen. I'm selling it to them for $50, the whole bag. Oh, he had a subscription well, service. Magazine, Especially you know niggas the, who got the bread and then they yeah, ready to spend whatever. Yeah, spend yeah. to be living spend. as comfortable yeah. as possible. Yeah, BBO magazine. That's, BBO. That's, that's a BBO that? magazine. For, since you don't know, that's, <laughs> that's the porno magazine. Oh, oh, I, heard, right. yeah, I, heard, I heard the porno magazine game industry is crazy. crazy. Oh my god, niggas pay, pay top dollar. You pay, you pay. I paid forty five dollars for three magazines. I'm selling a magazine, a hundred and fifteen dollars a magazine. What? What? Yo, bro, don't fuck up. But I also, I was making money. I heard niggas be renting the magazines and all that. Magazine, if you not, not in a box, because you know, yeah, not to get a box, yeah. but like if you're on a tier, niggas be renting the magazines, niggas sell it to people on the tier for them. And I heard place. niggas don't break the shit down, to page the page they yeah, got niggas to. used to break it down, niggas used to <laughs> take pages from niggas' magazines and make their own book with uh, that. Yo, pages, yo, <laughs> sell it to a nigga, like, yo, this the highlights, like, yo, yo listen, this listen, straight so, big booty bitches yo, right here, this the white bitches with the $75, $100, because it's hard to get in, so you have to work a certain job to be able to, like, help get the magazine. I also heard, though, like, if you if a nigga let you borrow his porno and you done made a mess and fucked one of his pages, you gotta pay for that, and he's still. Get to keep it, and yeah. he might knock you out. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> he nah, might still that's, that's, that's why. for that. Yeah, yeah. Niggas get me up that. But those but, is like, I don't. But like that, that star fights too. Sometimes you might get a nigga booked because like we, like certain judges, like I, right, when I was down in the day, right? Feel me? Like if you in the dorm. Mm-hmm. Only way to go, like, feel me, like, pull a spank man is to go in the shower. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You gotta go in the shower. You gotta go in the shower. Spank man, man. Like, <laughs> no. Spank your man. You figure it out. <laughs> yeah, it's like self explanatory. Yeah, yeah. Right? Every like, man gotta do it. Self explanatory. It's only much over the side before like, you're losing it. Like, you feel me? Like, <laughs> Man, listen. <laughs> I know niggas that. on the street side still do that. Like, listen, I ain't gonna say no names. <laughs> niggas, niggas think life is hard, bro. Imagine, imagine, no if, imagine not being able to go on fucking Pornhub, my nigga. You gotta Word. look at a magazine or use your imagination, Yo. and then you gotta think about man. It's nothing but niggas. Exactly. Right you now. gotta think about privacy. I can't even none think of that. Niggas around. Yeah. You got niggas that might, might you might be doing your thing. You want to shower, saying that way. Oh, Yo, shower. Yeah. It's crazy. Like, oh, this whole situation over. is done. Nigga. Done, done. <laughs> Schneiden. Uh, Beef yeah, up. Nah, nah, like, 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 nah. It's over. My Schneiden. Yeah, no, nobody want to do this no it's more. It's over. Damn, I son. know, yeah, bro. It's yeah. bad. Yeah, man. We can laugh about it because he's, the situation I've is over. It's yeah, like, bro, absolutely. It's nothing to be. It's nothing to be actually be laughing about when you think. They had good things though, like some like they did. Uh-huh. Like good, like had good I, educational programs. In there. That's yeah. I meant to ask you what was the best and the worst part about it. I mean, the worst part is probably being in there, but the worst part is definitely being in there. <laughs> that's that's easy to put. Worst part, other than being in there, is them faggot ass CEOs. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah. Like, some they of them, like some in? of them is cool. Like, don't get me wrong. I ain't gonna say like I, I ain't gonna say some right. names. Of course not. I I seen a few of them. Like one of them, like like a few, like one of them I seen. See him at the bowling alley, right? Uh-huh. Straight dickhead. <laughs> He's so scared when he see me. Was like, yo, he said my last name, yo, feel me, I don't care, I'm saying my last, yo, Ponton, <laughs> yeah, what's up, bro, yeah. like, you all right, like, 
Yo, bro, I just told you to suck my dick yeah. like the day before I left. Bro. I'll make like, sure I left you with a man. Tell her, I'll make sure with I left SMD. you with a Frank. You know what I mean? Yo, bro. I told, <laughs> he telling my man, like, yeah, this is my boy down there. He wasn't one of the other ones. I used to cook his food, but I never liked him because uh, the way he used to come to me. You should have spit Yo, make shit. sure you make, I did. Make sure you come. <laughs> like, shout out to my Mexican man. He got deported. Like, Shadow Sauce. His name was Shadow. You know shadow me? Sauce. He used to make Shadow Sauce for these CEOs. Like, we used to Oh, violate. Shadow Sauce. See, y'all be having a word. Y'all be having a word. Yeah, go crazy and shit. <laughs> he's like a separate pen just for like the niggas a shadow sauce like yo like yo he be like he's he Mexican yo money yo like money <laughs> he's saying he he's saying in Spanish so I understand yeah, yeah, certain yeah. shit like yo money like yeah, go ahead do your thing that's no that's that's that shadow sauce I'm like I right, say that money oh, tato 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 so Damn, you don't even know what you eating, yo, bro. Fuck but that. But it was cool, CEO from hood. Like my son was from Brooklyn. I see, I got him on the gram. That's my son. Shout out to uh, him. Yeah. Cool dude. I ain't gonna lie. I yeah. make sure I'm eating good. Yeah, like, that's oh, love. See, I always love hearing ODR, that. Oh, like, yeah. y'all. Oh, I work in ODR, y'all, so like I'll give him shit here, bring it back for me to the tier. That's love. Feel that's me? Or love if he working in here, let me bring it back. Or like he worked third shift. Yeah. Then then he used to work as a cook overnight. Oh, wow. So, Yo, yeah. go get that tray for my man. It's like, ah, uh, that's fine. Well, I had to figure it out. No, my that's man good. Q, like, my, my son, if my son, the CEO nigga, worked on my tea that night, or if I, if he come through and break that mm -hmm. night, Yo, bro, like, I'm starving, bro. Like, you got me? I'm really not starving. Though. I got a locker, <laughs> two lockers for yeah, 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 I just don't want to eat that shit. Yeah. Like, I've been ate, I didn't eat every type of hookup, yeah. chi chi and gel. <coughs> I, I hate that shit. Like, yeah, it's yeah. good, though. It's I cool, didn't made a few hookups. It's not some shit you would do. Oh, okay. But it's not some shit that I got, I got tired because I ate it every you single ate, day. Yeah, yeah. It was so it. real. I stopped eating hookups. I just started eating just straight soups. Like, I just eat yeah. one soup, like two soups, and just like. Yeah, it was, it was over with the creative shit. Got like, tired of and rice. Yeah, I got. I hated it after a while. Like, it, I is can't there wait to get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> I know that's what you was like, thinking. What? And getting that little month home in the my, middle of the bed had to be like, fuck, bro, I was right there. Like, nah, to be honest, I, like, I know I'm, I'm coming like, home. To be honest, I'm not gonna sound back. crazy. Like my first five, like. I ain't gonna say I didn't care about coming home or not. I just yeah. knew, I had a like I had a set date, so I knew when I was coming home. Right? Yeah. So it's like I was chilling. I ain't care. Like I'm like man, I'm good. I'm here I'm now. Here. So. Yeah. But it was when I had to go do my 585. I mean, when I had to go do the five years parole, mm. it was like I don't know when I'm coming home. Like, mm. like at first I'm like I'm supposed to do the 12 month hit. When you first when you have parole, when you first go home, like you first go back in, they give you a 12 month hit. All right. They supposed to let you go after that. Like it's a law now that they passed. It's called double jeopardy. They're not supposed yeah. to double hit jeopardy. You. Yeah. They're not supposed to hit you for the same thing twice. Like the same thing. Whoa. They hit me with that. Because I was gonna again. say, bro, you went away for another I was, five. I went away for four. another four. Yeah, about for your four. I was four, supposed actually. to do. I was supposed to just do twelve months. I was in the camps, like I said earlier. I was right. in the camps, about to go to the half. I'm like, I'm not gonna go to the half. Let me just see what this is about. Right. You know I mean, let me see about parole. I'm about to see parole. I was in the worst jail to ever see parole. That. Oh man. They gave me sixteen extra months off the jump. So I'm like, how y'all gonna give me 16 months? I'm in the camps. Yeah. I'm supposed to go to the halfway. I'm been supposed thought, to go yeah, by yeah. just cancel it so I can right. see y'all. And like everybody in there was in the halfway house. They hit everybody with 22 months. I was the least. Right. The, the, the second least was 22 months. Everybody got hit with 22, 30 month hits. Yeah. I got 16. So I did the 16. I got shipped out to go back to Border Town. I was already in Border Town, but I went back yeah, to that was, that was Gladiator School. Yeah, I went back to Gladiator School, but I'm in the <laughs> camp part now, Gladiator School. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay. It's completely separate. No, yeah. y'all, I ain't gonna lie, yeah, Gladiator School, that was the worst. That was like it's like probably worse, but Yardville is probably the worst jail to ever be in. Cause you could order like say we order today, we won't get that order for another month. Oh, it's supposed oh, to be every nah. two months. So you on edge? They was back, nah. Yeah, they was backed up. If you like in jail, they say like heavy, like meaning like you got mad food. So if you was heavy in jail, like mm -hmm. if you was heavy, then you had to be somebody from. Uh, yeah, they selling food, cash. Like yo, Dang. send me this money on JP or cash. Have me the bread. Give me fifty dollars. Gonna get you like thirty dollars worth of food from them. Damn. But so it was like you got to hustle. Like my, I'm, like I met a cousin in jail right. from Trent. Like yeah. I met my family and that's my cousin. Crazy. That's that's you crazy. You met him in, in jail. Yeah, yeah that's crazy. Be cool with him. He's in jail still. He had went friend. home and then got locked back up because his cousin told him. From Damn. Me. Now I'm talking like, about that it, though. Yeah, it'd be, be like a money that. nigga. He from Trent. I ain't gonna lie. That's fire though. He he, be back home he was so heavy downstate. So yeah. when we got cool. At first he was selling me stuff. Then we found out we were family. Oh, I was good. Oh, he went home. He left me everything. He left me the whole empire. He had like ten bins worth of food. Literally, like he had food in other niggas' room. <laughs> it was so yeah, whole lot, yeah, like, <laughs> and he was the store, so like the store is like, yo, let me get a one for two. So like, when you get your canteen back, you gotta give me two back. Oh, so he had a book. Hard. He had a book. See, he was getting gotta, money. You gotta hustle. Like you gotta yeah, really hustle. Yeah, right. It's literally really that. Man, it's like, a survival for I got one for two. Like if it's canteen that bad, one for three. So when yeah. canteen come, I need three back for this one. Is, is, is there, is there anything that you eat now um, that you developed while you in? 
Anything that you eat now that you that I never ate before? Yeah, I, I never ate onions and peppers before, and I I, I eat it now. Oh, yeah, I have no choice but to eat. But I mean, you started you started chefing, so I know yeah, you started, started learning really some on shit the grill there. with like yeah. yeah. But I still never liked onions and peppers before. Yeah, me neither. Until I tried to go vegan for like ten weeks, and I, was, yeah. I fell in love with onions and peppers. Yeah, I love onions. Dead ass. Now, but they gotta be cut small. They gotta be like that, they yeah. gotta be sauteed. Type <laughs> shit. Like, they, got, they can't just be regular onions and peppers. Don't no, like no nah. wrong. We used to just like get those. I used to get those from work, mm-hmm. bring it back to the tent, sell it. A dollar finger out the glove. Well, I was gonna say, um, so what about like cell phones? I always heard cell phones is a big nah, thing in general. Only in the feds. Only in the feds. Only in the feds. Only in the feds. Oh, it's it's see, real hard. It's to get so cell different. State. People gotta Don't understand. Get me wrong, though. State and feds. When I was in the camps, now y'all real right. Uh-huh. I ain't gonna lie. You just had the phone in there, but I wasn't there for that. I had just got shipped out because uh-huh. that jail was so free. No cameras in there at all. Like in that no camps, cameras. No, the whole jail had no cameras when I first got there. They put cameras in the main population in the mm-hmm. camps. It was so free. We leave grounds. Right, so yeah, people yeah, could outside. meet. Like, people could, like, I could be like, yo, Jit. I could call you, like, yo, Jit, uh uh-uh, uh, yo, come visit me. Because yeah. I ain't going to talk over the phone. You get caught up like that. Yeah. You come visit me, like, yo, listen, bring me some K. Go give me an uh, ounce of K, an ounce of weed, and, 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 and a pack, like, five packs of buglers and put it in the glove. Drop it off here. Uh, I'm going to get it because I know my detail going You know exactly day. where it's going to oh, be at. Yo, bring the phone. That's how they got the phone in. You don't have to go. You don't always like certain workers. Don't have to go through the metal detector when you come back in the metal detect like that shit. If you see what it look like, you're like, it's not no secure shit. Like, it's secure when you look in the inside, but on the outside, be like, man, what? Yeah, yeah. Of yeah. course you could get it in. Yeah, that's crazy. It's so they had got the phone in there. You be seeing crazy they shit. They had Jack in there when and I left. I heard niggas was on Facetime, <laughs> yeah, Instagram I Live. My man like, went viral. My son Max went viral in LA County like five years ago on like Twitter or some shit. Yeah, see, that's a different state. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Yeah. No, but I, I just remember this nigga was literally on Instagram going viral as we spoke. Like in a day, he gained like twenty five hundred followers in just that like thirty minutes that he was on live, and then the rest of that day, then his shit got caught up. Yeah, and he blah blah blah. Yeah. He good or now. He gonna be telling. Or even halfway house too. halfway house too, you can sneak a little. Oh, jacket. I've heard about that too. My brother's keeping jacket. that shit at the school because they, they let you go to school sometimes. Yeah, you go to school, you work. All like yeah. no, like my son Denny, he works. Yeah. And all that. What was the What was the craziest shit you think you ever seen? Like rather it be violent or rather it be I don't know, like just the wildest shit. Because I didn't heard crazy stuff. I didn't heard niggas get married in jail, and I'm like, what? Or like I heard about. I know somebody co- got married. In jail, <laughs> got married but but married to another inmate or married to another like, yeah, inmate exactly. inside and married to that's fine. I know C. I've heard got pregnant. What? Like what? She was from Camden. My but, man got but, pregnant from the one of the inmates. Well, that's from the inmates. <laughs> she, she was that's in love with my thing. man. She got my man name title oh. while he was in jail. Still? Yes, while he was in jail. That's tough. That's got tough. Pregnant while but he that's was in jail. man. The 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 if, if you can go on any female attention while you in jail, man, that hurt. That, that shit is, is everything. I can well, imagine. Attention? Like yeah, any female attention. Like yeah, if you yeah, yeah, like if you got girls writing letters, like it's those things that keep niggas alive and going well. It was a lot. of female COs there. Like a lot. Like it outweighed the male COs. So like. You had and they used to like I ain't gonna lie they used to mess around like yeah. it was a, like, if you was somebody and like you carried this not even carried this yourself about somebody how do everybody around you carry like yeah like right yeah. now if I'm in there and y'all with me and y'all like I like I'm like fake the big homie like a little mm-hmm. bit yeah. and they feel like they could sense that and they know that a little bit and they act they act around too then you be good like if you you in there or you yeah. can highlight other seals that you cool with yeah. like other female old heads those like yo what's it's, up yo you could tell like it's, I said like. Like, tell I said, what's up? Like, I ain't gonna lie. Like, that's how I be. Like, that ass. Like, that's that's how crazy, though. Like, some nah, niggas that's not really gonna crazy. say that. Some niggas gonna be like, they gonna catch him. Like, we ain't no cam. Like, at the desk, ain't no cams right there. At yeah, the desk. pop on him, like, what's up? Like, I ain't gonna lie. I, I, I seen you. Yeah. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. CEOs, like, like, female CEOs doing shit. Like, like in, in Gladiator School, I ain't gonna lie. I was the shot. I was the only jail. Like, pulls, like, you got five niggas in the shower. Like, it's five showers. Yeah, it's yeah, supposed yeah. to be five niggas. Be about 10 of them niggas in there. Gangster. What? Shout out to each other. Pulls. Yeah. Nah, nigga, nigga, yo, what? That nah, shit went left. I have to, though. I thought he was going to say nah, niggas look, going in there one at a time. Nah, he said, nah, nah it's 10 niggas nah, in look, there. Don't look, though. CO's, she used to go, like, when CO working there, she used to go all the way in there just to tell niggas to get out, but she wanted to look, though. Yeah, of course. We know what she wanted to look. Yeah. She giving it off, she wanted to look, because she, she comes in there every two minutes. Oh, and she don't yeah. work the tears like that. Like, she didn't, that, that Pacific one didn't work yeah, the tears like that. She, she just horny at the shower. She just had yeah. horny, she had some mad gel, chiseled body, bro. Yeah. Yeah. Feel me? I'm so, crying. like, she's in there, like, I ain't gonna lie, she used to do that shit. I'm like, oh wow, so they, they used to want to like, they used to want to play for me. Yeah, that's I, wild. I, I, that I, is I, mad. Have I ever? No, I haven't. Yeah, cause I was gonna that, say yeah. like, at what point can you fuck a CEO in jail? How do it's you like even get that time? Third shift. Like when time, like when they lock, you know, we locked in a lot of the times. Yeah. So like when you locked in, they try to they pop your door open. Yo, you might be a worker. You could be a tear worker. Like when you're a tear worker, you out all day. Uh-huh. Yeah. From count from when count like start. I mean clear to count up. 
Like I was working a lot of jobs. Oh, you walking around? You, you so just a tear though. I'm yeah. walking around the tear. Like oh, I don't okay. have to lock in. So like yeah, why everybody locked in? I'm on the phone all day. Oh, that's hard though. Feel me? Like I was a bully a little bit. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah. <laughs> I used to be a worker, and I used to be a worker. I used to be out from about. Six in the morning. See, but the funny thing is, the work is supposed to be for niggas with good behavior. So you was you was nah, finessing everything. People that's good behavior. People, I could have shown they, workers they, they, like people that people you had to be work, a certain like behavior no, first. Like, workers is for like if you gangster and you can control certain <laughs> shit, you can work. The CEOs like you. They be like, oh, I, I feel like you can control that. Mm -hmm. So like, I like, if I tell like even though niggas don't do it, like certain niggas do that. Like we call it cop shit. Certain niggas be like, yo, like like niggas get too loud. Yo, 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 be quiet, be quiet. The CEO say like. Me, I never personally did that. Yeah, bro. Yeah, yeah. I'll go to a few people like I ain't gonna lie, he gonna lock you in if you don't like. If you don't yeah, know, yeah, like, yeah. Me personally, I don't care. Do y'all if you do. If y'all wanna stay out, watch your TV because there ain't no TVs out, in the rooms down here. Chill out, but I don't care. Do y'all? But niggas be like, yo, bring it back, bring it back on cop shit. Niggas don't even know niggas about to throw a thousand francs at you. Like, <laughs> so I'm like, take it back, you take it back. Like, yeah, like, I was around a lot of ruthless <laughs> north niggas that do not care about that. They was mad deep. Yeah. They all from the same hood. Man, suck my dick, and they gonna jump you after that. You feel me? So oh like, man. Right. Now you good. <laughs> That's tough. So it's like, all right, I ain't gonna lie. You gotta be somebody to be like. They gotta know that you're somebody and know that you like. You hold some type of way a little. Like they, yeah. they ask other people. They won't specifically ask you for me, and they just be like, "Why oh, do you'll be a worker? You'll yeah. be good." What you? What was? What was probably like the scariest shit? Cause I don't heard crazy shit too. Like niggas getting hit with bricks, or I done seen. I heard a story. Of niggas like literally found a nigga hanging off the off the tier one time, like with a with a fucking. All right, blanket, when I was down like, Yardville, my son. Niggas from Patterson, they had the nigga from over on the third floor over the balcony because uh -huh. they had beef uh -huh. on the streets. Yeah. Like certain hoods, like they continue they beef on the streets in jail. Yeah, yeah. That's very rare in jail, feel me? The very uh -huh. rare. Like they still be sticking with each other. I can't do it. Like, if I beef with you on the streets, we gonna beef everywhere. Yeah. <laughs> so well, I see you. I see you, nigga. It's like, so like they had the you. nigga hanging off the third floor trying to throw him off, but he was hanging on for dead life. Uh, that's not stuff like that. Don't be scary to me. Yeah, like, but that shit is crazy. Like, you really that's crazy. That, like, like, you on the third floor? Like third floor? floor? That's thirty feet. Like, he's hitting. That's I'm in the room. I'm in the room. I got the I got the door. Like I got oh, the, so you the, got the window. So I'm looking like oh. oh. I'm like yo. I'm like yo, dump him. <laughs> third floor. <laughs> that's that's, 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 you, that's thirty feet, bro. That's thirty feet. You go. No, it's the wraparound stairs. Like you come up the steps. Oh, it's the wraparound. Go like this, and then go back around. Go up. Oh yeah, that's he high as hell. Yeah, he damn near. He like he damn near like sixty feet. Yeah. So it's like, damn, nah, man, you fall from there, nigga. There was oh. all types of weird gay shit going on. It was uh, trainees yeah. in there. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. niggas they, fucking uh, with the trainees in there. You know, it was <laughs> outrageous. They finally gave but the trainees their own thing. jail. That's always, yeah. They got their own jail? Nah, they, they go to the female jail. You ain't just see the shit on the news? Yeah, I was about to say, yeah. The trainee got the inmates pregnant. I saw that, I saw that, I saw that. Yeah, hell yeah. I saw that. That's not even just happening. The trainees, they had trainees. It was the one trainee. Well, no, because he was one was gangster. Oh, I can imagine. Oh, first yeah, nah. He wasn't a trainee nah, niggas, first. But like, pause. Niggas <laughs> like, knew the nigga, though. Like, he was from North. Like, his, he brother, was, his brother was crit. Like, his brother so was what you're telling me is this nigga like was that. really like that. Yes, and but then... no homo. Like, no homo. I'm going on the record. I'm going to keep saying no yeah. homo, no homo. <laughs> This nigga had ass and titties in jail, bro. <laughs> this nigga had upper body strength on here. Niggas in jail is so paused. Like, this shit used to get me so mad, bro. Like, niggas in jail is so paused. Yeah. They gave a nigga a name and all that. What you mean? Like, like no, homo, yeah, no homo, no homo. This nigga name was Amber Rose, bro, because he had the body, bro. <laughs> nah, hey, bro. yo, hey, fucking yo. Yeah. Bro. Like, I used to be mad. This is crazy. walking. <laughs> Hey, like, yo, Amber Rose. I'd be like, yo, that's yo, a bro, nigga. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> nigga, that nigga's Laquan. Yeah, the nigga, I forgot, like, the nigga name was such and such, bro. Like, yeah, like, like, what, bro? Like, you're not even supposed to be calling him, bro. Yo, like, I'm the crying. fuck? Nah, but the nigga was gangster, but his brother was well respected. Yeah. But his brother mm -hmm. didn't care, like, bro. My brother, like, that nigga trained me. Yeah, yeah, I don't yeah, care. Yeah, like, but the nigga could fight. <laughs> I believe it. I believe it. Be like he that. I shit up. Like, I believe that. Breaking CO's up. How the fuck he even ended up in jail? Like, what the fuck? Nigga was like 6'3, breaking shit up. Nah, 6'3. Hey, yo, niggas close yeah, in my bro. Bro. Was, They had their own tear, but it was niggas <laughs> on their tear down there. Like in certain, like when I was in Annaville. Certain, like niggas so on their tear. you see like niggas sneaking off, like Tracy Morgan and them and all. Nah, um, niggas, CO's, yeah, CO's, CO's, CO's <laughs> telling niggas, and then like if you're a worker, you could go inside the, you could go inside the office, like with a microwave, I got microwave access. Damn. You could drink oh. their coffee out the coffee pot with them if you were a worker. Like I was good. Nigga, they showing niggas on camera like, yo, nigga just went in the room with the nigga like, oh, wow. so it's a lot right. of action. And, 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 for that, in four K, like, like yeah. somebody knew Muslim you. brother, like stuff for the law, like yeah. he was in the room with the nigga like, oh, you duck, like he came out the room greased up, and he went to lock up for that. 
What? He, and he was the, blood. He's not blood no more. <laughs> what? They, they, call him on, they call him on so, 4K. Hey, yo. Damn, bro. That was the crazy like shit I seen. But, like, and I don't know. That used to mesmerize. Like, what the fuck? Like, yeah. hey, yo. Right. Like, what? You realize, like, yo, this shit this is, is a, real. Like, like, this, like, I'm chilling playing ball when the nigga first came, bro. A trainee walk and they like, yo, look at the train. I'm like, why the fuck do you want to look at the train? I'm playing yeah, basketball right now. But I mean, it's mind blowing too because like, niggas. I don't like, want to, but niggas the is like, because niggas I'm turn their head like that even in, in regular life. Niggas That's yeah. what I'm saying. Yeah, I'm walking past like, niggas convos like, yeah, if you had 15, you doing that? Hey, fuck you, mean? Yo, listen, shit, you know me. I'm walking past. I hear that. Like, like, what? Yo, like, what you say? I know you're big, bro. I'm about to holler at you, bro. Like, what type of time you want? Hey, yo, man, I can imagine, but it it gets real. It's just that humans, you know, saying like they said, you got that 15. People start thinking like that. Like, man, I ain't never gonna get. I did 10. I ain't never think about that. You And I and I can imagine you gotta be you gotta be here because some niggas lose it. They go into that box. They lose it. They they. I did the box. I right. did a year back there. Yeah, what? Well, well, um, I was actually gonna ask you that whole time you was in there. What's the longest you heard anybody had in there? Like that was that was doing like the time. In the box? No, anyway. Period. Jail? Yeah, like you you was ran to a nigga. He oh. was like, yeah, I got 110 years, nigga. No, I haven't <laughs> ran nobody who had that shit. I ran somebody who had 30. Damn. I ran to my son, yeah. my son Fat Fat from Patterson Free Fat Fat. He had Fat like, Fat. I think he had 17 or something like that. Yeah. yeah. I ran to some nigga who had 27. Damn. Oh yeah, you were saying you were in the you in, uh, in the youth, right? In, yeah. uh, under twenty eight. That's my age. Like wow. so, since nineteen, twenty. Right. I was like when I was like twenty three, niggas was like nineteen coming in there with bodies. Like I got twenty seven. They still walking. That. It was my man. Like I know a nigga down Trenton right now. He got like fifty. Oh my he god. He Trenton yeah. State. He like nineteen. He's with niggas that's nineteen. He like with niggas that's like. He with niggas that's like. No bullshit. Life is. 40 years old. Life is. Life is. He's, he's in there. He's in there. Yeah. Yeah. I already got that gay mindset. Like, yeah, yeah, right. Because that's what I'm saying. Home. They're never coming they, home. They already and had that, that mindset. That like, switches that, that, It's different. So, you know what I'm saying? Like, free that, my man's. My man's got 18. He got like, free damn. my son Bream. He from, he from RPT. He right, got 18. Damn. Shit, man. That shit hurts. But it, it, this goes. my son Stunner. My son, Stunner. My, son, my son Phil Gates. He got... He got like eighteen. He out of town too. Damn. Yeah. Nah, I guess like that's that's real. Like when like you when you hit that. For my son, a one. He from he from Morris. He from B one block. I ain't yeah. gonna lie. He got like I think he got Almost twenty. Yeah, he got like twenty free him too. Twenty. Yeah, that, that, nah, he's in New York. Oh, he's oh, he, in New York. Yeah, yeah. that's twenty forty. Think about free it. Like, thing, bro, that sounds he crazy. Right he, he, he be home very soon. He just shot a music video. You and D thing actually go up to that little cop brother, right? That's how I'm gonna tell you. That's family. Free D thing. He just they just did a music video for him. Fresh Montana came to River Park Town. Yeah, I know. I seen French been showing him mad love since, sure. they, since the beginning. A, they got a song together. That's hard. That's yeah, hard. That's a good look. He did a video. It's that's him, Band on T Dot. Shout out to Band on T Dot. Damn, that's fire. But listen, mm -hmm. we, we definitely got. That's crazy. You just had 50, 40, 30, all them years, yeah. bro. That shit don't even sound real. That don't even sound so, real. Like, and that, that, and that, and that's, that's why I make my little nine years. Like, and make it sound like, like y'all. But Cake Wolf, they did that like. Three times already. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. You, you went in 16, came out 25. 21. 20, no, I'm saying came oh, out. All together? Saying, all together. 25. Like 25. Yeah. Right? Turned 26 and in a couple months. Man. I mean, a couple weeks, In a couple weeks, yeah. A couple weeks, man. So, I mean, when people don't realize is that a lot of the kids I know that, that might be listening to this right now, they're like 17, 18. They getting hit with the same kind of times. And they thinking yeah, this shit is old. All the kids that's old. watching this and everybody who's watching this, if y'all not gangster and y'all trying to be, don't be. Because there's niggas that's really like that that don't even want to be that no more. Blur. Yo. That shit. Guys, that don't even want to be that Oh, that's no, different, y'all. Yeah. Don't even want to be there no more. You and it, it hits you too late. You already you're five already, ten yeah. years into your sentence. Like, I yo, I got another twenty of this shit. It's, the the no reality way. has already set I, in. I'm right. like, niggas, I've got to do all this time. I did not. They talk about they got to do three years, one year. I'm like, y'all complain about that. I just did yeah. that like five times already. I lose yeah. twelve months. Like, and I, I know that I heard that building animosity too. Like, when motherfucker walk in there, like, yeah, I'll be out here in two years, and these niggas in there with fifteen. And niggas be hot. Like, man, nah, and they hear and they complain though. But I'm saying like, niggas be complaining. They complain to something. Niggas be acting. I'm like, yo, bro, like, yo, bro, like, bro relax, shut up, bro. Like, yeah, like, you complaining. You gonna I got, be out here in a second. I got 15, bro, and I only got two years in, bro. Mm -hmm. Like, That's I got to do a 15 with 85, and I got parole five Ooh. years. And then you talk about Damn. you gotta do a three with a one. Yeah, that's and you could go home after you you max out in thirty in two and a half years. Or you yeah. can come home in a year and on parole. Yeah, that shit is unreal. You, know you said you say you got off officially in March, right? Yeah. So you know, I'm glad that's all behind you now. You know, it's all I'm, I'm me, glad. Man. All behind. Yeah. And wait, if I'm not mistaken, for real, for real. correct me if I'm wrong. You bit got off parole, didn't you? March. Yeah, March. Yeah. 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 You maxed out. 
Yeah, I so yeah, that's what I'm saying. You was gone, you feel me? No for real, no paper, no nothing. I mean, we walking around. That's what I like to hear. Nah, man, for sure. That's that's a. I know that's a hell of a feeling, man. Yeah, I'm so happy. I was at the bar for like a week straight. A week straight. It's like, man, I couldn't even drink. I couldn't do nothing. It's all with my lady. Drunk world with my lady. Nah, I know you've been doing a lot since you came home, man. You've been. Yeah, man. I've been trying to focus and trying to get money. Yeah, you know, do what you gotta do, man. Do what I gotta do. And man. the fact that you're so young, people don't have that perspective. Because when you 18 and you hit, I'm not getting. And out that's so like crazy. Seven. A lot of people, like if you don't know me, I don't give off that vibe. I just did nine years. Not, yeah. not at all. Not, not at, at all. all. Still in the loop. Not right? at you all. You don't even give off the vibe to me, honestly, as a tough guy at all. Because ever since I know you, always been a funny nigga to me. Yeah. But right. I always seen you when it turned up. I, it's different. As far as tough like, wise, like a lot of people who do all the time, they come home with it, like a messed up mind frame. Like, and they stuck their mind is still out there. Everybody's gonna be a little bit institutionalized. I still have a little bit of things. But I just don't show it Yeah you came to my house And I did a hundred push ups In ten seconds I was like what the <laughs> fuck Was that about Yo word too Nigga was like yo bro I could do a thousand push ups I'm like nigga shut up He's like, I'll do a hundred right now Like as far as mindset Not even about being tough or not, like, <laughs> like, like a lot of people Like if I don't If I just make sure Something like that If I don't tell you I did ten years You won't never know nah. I did it Yeah you know You don't, you don't walk around like, like How that, you like, just like You just still in the loop Like how you like uh, I'll be like I just did like Married up and shit you Yeah me? for real for real Everyone pressed on Louis You would never know You heard my son Get to the back Yo, how you like? Like I ain't gonna lie, like you, like you in the loop. Like you don't even look like you did. <laughs> yeah. You don't even look like you did a year. Like you all the way in the loop. Like yeah, you still sure. know. You talking to me like you regular. Like you ain't do like all that time. Like and people don't even know how to talk now that did all that time. I'm like, nah. yeah, word. And man, like, and the, and the thing is, like you know, there's a lot of people who might be teenagers. You know, might have to do a bit or whatever. They think their life is over with. You know, we still young out here. Yeah, exactly. At the end of the day, so crazy. we still got I so to, much I life in front of us. And I was gonna, I'm, I, I want to talk to like, you feel me? Like, I think you should. Nah, absolutely. Cool head, yeah. down there. Nah, I absolutely. My, I went to the youth house that I was at. I got my high school That's, diploma in the yo, youth house in that, uh -huh. I went there and I told them like they wanted me to come talk to them. Nah, them congratulations to that for real. Man, listen, absolutely. I know you got a whole lot of big things coming. Our journey is just beginning for real. Absolutely, you know what I'm saying? Plenty money on the way, millions on the way. I'm saying, I want to spend. A, a special thank you again, bro, for telling your story. Yo, you thank you for that. We appreciate you, man. Oh, yeah, we know. Oh, no, absolutely. We got to bring some homies in that you, you know what I'm saying, that you have been in there with so you can tell some real stories. Listen, man, this has been another episode of the, the Free Jams, Jams Podcast. Uh, episode 11. Thank episode you guys 11. so much. Big, big shout out to my brother, J-Hop. We're going to have his ad name in the description. You know, absolutely. Right? You know what I'm saying? Big shout out, J-Hop. Make sure y'all follow, too. Don't forget to follow. Don't forget to comment. Don't forget to subscribe. All that. And listen, if you're going through anything in life, man, feel free to reach out to either one of us, especially if you got a situation going on, he can relate to a lot of shit y'all going on through. So, you know what I'm saying? Any type of situation y'all need, y'all can just DM me and whatever the case may be. So, there you go. It's a big, big thank you, man. It's the Free Gems Podcast. Free Gems, thank you, baby. man. We are And we are out of here. Right. <laughs> go, My nigga.